Ooh, what's this? Two Heinschwartz. Topkoff Staffel. North 13. I believe it's North 13. Dear Heinrich, I hope this letter finds you well. I am sitting outside on the porch of the hospital where I am recovering from my wounds. A good-looking nurse rolled me out here so I could write to you. A volunteer from Munich tells me here in Dar es Salaam, afternoon is drawing near. A chilled breeze comes in from the sea, and with the breeze comes a smell of fish and rotting seaweed, and the, um, and the almost unbearable stench from the burning bodies by the shoreline. The view of the land from this location is absolutely gorgeous. I have found Africa to be, in many ways, a wondrous place. It has an air of freedom, a sense of adventure, if you will. I wish you could experience it with me, Heinrich. I have also seen things I wish I could have unseen. Remember how I told you once that I would never regret my decision to quit my education and join the army? To be honest, in the grimmest moments, I have cursed my decision. I still ponder this, but if I hadn't left the university, would I not still have felt as lost and aimless as I did? Speaking of which, how is Elsa? Have you spoken to her at all? Have you seen her? On campus, perhaps? On the street? Or by the river where we used to fish? Maybe I should not ask this, but I do think of her when darkness falls over the desert. It's comforting. The violence can be duff tough to handle. Some of the men are losing it. They say we shouldn't be even be here, and I understand why they say this, especially the less experienced ones. They're afraid, you see, afraid of the guerrilla soldiers, the primitives. Oh, wow, that's a little insulting. <laughs> a month ago, we were out in the desert. I was piloting my wolf tank. We were four men in a tank. Mean, Housewolf, Gunther, and Kellerman. Have you seen these tanks? They come straight out of General Strauss's workshop. They're fueled by nuclear reactors and armed with state-of-the-art weaponry. A troop of wolf tanks can decimate an entire village in the blink of an eye. However, the one thing these machines of war can't can't handle is the abundant in the desert sand okay hold up seriously they made it well i know they didn't make a tank like that but if they did they should already fucking won <laughs> we didn't see it coming somewhere close to the tanganjinkan border i don't know how to pronounce that so i'm just going with whatever fucking thing comes out of my mouth a dust storm blew up out of nowhere. Within minutes, everything was covered in sand. It got to the engines through the cracks in the hull and caused the tanks to malfunction. Suddenly, we found ourselves stranded. We had no choice but to set up camp. There were 20 of us in our squad. We took turns guarding the perimeter. I was awoken by a blood-curdling scream in the middle of the night. I ran outside. The camp was in a state of absolute chaos. My men were running like headless chickens while dark men, primitives, dressed in strips of leather, faces painted red, and the whites of their eyes glowing in the darkness, leaped across the camp and gutted slashed and slashed our men i got i saw gunther eviscerated where he stood he tried to hold his guts in but they slipped through his fingers you know i'm kind of regretting speaking this out loud because that's the type of shit that you don't want to see or hear one of the primitives came at me from nowhere and, I, and stabbed me in the stomach. I managed to grab my gun and shot him dead. I pulled out the knife and crawled away from the scene and ran across the desert, the terrible screams haunting me through the night. I was told they kept some of them alive to torture while the dead were hung upside down, disemboweled, and their sexual organs cut off and shoveled down their throats. Okay. If I ever come across more of these letters, I'm just not going to read them. Or I might. I guess it really kind of depends on how I feel. So you understand that a lot of the men here, they are beginning to lose their morale, and to a degree that is understandable. I, however, will not surrender these feelings of weakness. No matter how tempting they may be, I will stand by my belief in the ideals of our leader. We are a strong race, and there could be no room for anyone but us. I hope you still feel the same way as I do. Your friend, Oscar Weissmuller, 72nd Wolf Tank Division. Okay then. Um, don't know how to feel about that. I really don't. Should I feel bad for him, or should I kind of hate him because he's still kind of a fascist? Um, not sure. I guess I'll find out later. Uh, let's go, let's go. I need more ammo. Huh, rhymed. Oh, shit. I forgot. Why do I keep forgetting? You die, and you die. Die. Okay. 
We're gonna just nade the fuck out of these guys. Oh, you bitch! You bitch! Get back! Whoa, what the hell happened to his body, dude? What the fuck? That is both awesome and fucking terrifying. Just... And he turned red. Huh. <laughs> Just because I love this gun. Da. <laughs> 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 I just really love this gun. Okay. Alright, let's see. <laughs> oh, Private Wyatt. Okay, so out of grenades. Hmm. Yeah, I forgot there was only two. Just gonna drop that gun real quick and turn and turn and turn and turn and you're dead. Ha! He went up like a piece of gore. Awesome. Ooh. Yes! I managed to pick it up without picking up the other gun. I really didn't want to get back on that gun, mostly because I shouldn't. Mostly because it's like kind of useless. But... Let's spin her up. And dead! <laughs> Did you see the way he flipped around? That was awesome. Wow, my feet are really uncomfortable in this sitting position. <gasps> doggy, 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 dog. Where is gonna be a fucking dog? I know there's gonna be one soon. Oh shit. Yeah, this dog is not one I want to see. What? No. Why would it fall for that? It's a robot. It shouldn't have fell for that. Um. Pay attention, beer boys. This is all time for a goose hunt to stick up job. <sighs> those words make me regret the decision I made in my last game. I did not realize those words until now. Proud gate, sirs. Important for duty. Crazy undelegated. Welcome to the war. Take over, Private. Now, General Death's head. It sounds like everybody in the war. Yes. I'm asking you to go that private. Be sure to mind that bleed. We eliminate the general, we cut the head off the cold war machine. If we don't, they're gonna have us for breakfast. Uh, you alright there, kid? Sir, my eyes are watering. And I think I'm gonna be sick. Is this normal? It's just nerves. I'm gonna teach you a trick. Inhale. Down to four. Exhale. <sighs> All there is to Well, having our ass tanned by some Nazi mutant fucking Frankenstein. So we're ready there, lads. This time, we get the job done. Well, let's go. Let's move it on. Go. I'm expecting I or the Tiger to start playing with this. Although I'm pretty sure I muted the music, so I don't know if I'm gonna get copyrighted for this shit. I really hope I'm not. Wasn't insulting, I'd have called that one eyed guy Cyclops. Does that make me insensitive? Then again, this is a game, so. Find Death's head and shoot him in the head. Hmm. Interesting. Wow, my guy's like pretty much fucked. If 
thank you for dying in an organized manner. Can I really? Oh, I can't. Okay, did not want to do that. Big rock. I'm gonna avoid it. Die, bitch. Damn. Shit. He's dead. Almost there, sir. Just keep walking. Come on, where's the reload? Oh, I'm out of ammo. Yep, just gonna use this. I'm sorry, sirs. Oh. I didn't see him coming. No. No, you didn't have to die. Well, shit. Let's hope you just kind of live. Ooh, armor. I forgot that all these boxes are openable, so... wonder what's inside. Ooh, ammo. <gasps> Alright, not ammo. Health. The... Yep, because knifing that was effective. <laughs> I stabbed him in the ass again. <laughs> oh, I keep finding that so funny. Just a knife toss. <laughs> Each and every time. So, just gonna knife toss that guy and take down that dog. And grenades, please. Please, grenades. Yes. Ooh, did I get another knife? If I did, awesome. <gasps> no fucking way. I already got the silencer. Yes. I'm going to put that silencer on. And now I got my favorite weapon. I didn't know I could get it this early on. I thought I had to get it way later. I guess I was wrong. <laughs> Headless bitch. <laughs> Shot you in the face. You got domed, son. Ooh, another grenade. I could use that. More grenades. Don't need it. Ooh, that's a lot of armor. I can't help but wonder what's behind this door. If there's anything at all. Oh, it's locked. I guess there's nothing. Oh, hello. Yeah, I'll take that ammo. Okay, so over this precarious walkway. You know, these are the moments where I'm like, should I be using a silenced pistol or should I be using... So, yeah, we're going to wait till he's over here, and then I'm going to shoot him in the back of the head, execution style. Alright, come on. Execution. Execution! <laughs> execution. My favorite kind. Bye bye, doggy. Should I be conflicted on that? 
Ooh, what? No. <gasps> no way. Oh my god, seriously. I never fucking knew this. This is amazing. No. <gasps> Sweet. Yes. Ah. There is beast. I'm loving this even more. Dude, that just made my mission so much fucking easier. question is, is like when the dogs do that, how do people not hear, like how do they not hear the dog wolfing consistently? Like that should be one thing people would hear a lot, is like, hmm, my dog's barking a little strangely. He's normally told to keep quiet. Maybe I should check this out. He's dead. Okay, let's hope there's not one more dog. Because if there is, it's gonna be problems. Okay, I think they're all dead. Pretty sure they're all dead. Yep, they're all dead. Okay. Not sure how to go about that, but whatever. They're all dead. I can deal with this. Oh, you fucker. He's headshot. Bitch. Well, that was enough to shut him up. What? You kidding me? Where? From where? Where am I getting shot from? Who in the fuck? Dead, finally, fuck. You die. Thank you. Seriously. Ser ser seriously? Ser Pissing me off now. Fuckers. Thank you for dying. Thank you. God. No. So, max ammo for the assault rifle, but my pistol has to suffer. <laughs> Doggy. Dude, did he phase through those boxes? If so, amazing, but at the same time, disturbing. <gasps> Ooh, dog chow. Because obviously that's healthy. Oh, wow. They're dead. I honestly wasn't expecting that. What? Why did you take it? Oh, whatever. I don't care. Detached or not, I'm still gonna get the kills. Basically. Okay. Dude! Okay, that's it. Now I'm pissed. Oh, you'll die. Oh, you'll die, oh, you'll die. 
Probably don't die. Die, damn it, die. Jesus. Okay. Troop transport. Our tank is. Say this too many times. Why can't I put two silencers on? Can't move this beam from our position. We're trapped up here, Blaskowitz. See if you can move right. this beam from your position. Side. Sir, maybe you can use this to pry it loose. Oh. Okay. Thanks for the pipe. Oh, it's a beam. A tiny beam, but a beam. Yeah, what's That's interesting. In I thought it was a pipe. It looked yeah. kind of more well, like a pipe. Sort of sort of bombing him at the moment. It's a bit of a problem. Edward, Bloody, mm. get up! Seriously? Se seriously? I mean, ser you guys are arguing back and forth like you're not friends. You're allies, you dumb fucks. And yes, the churches are in England. Come on, but I boy. guess this was the normal by play they had, I guess. All right, time to run and jump. No. Oof. Thank you for catching me. Even though that jump should have totally had me landing on my feet. Oh, fuck. That looked painful. Oh, oh. oh fucking circus. My feet are broken. What is this place? So. Oh. Oh, was that a new mission? No. Okay, so. That is demented as shit. Oh my god, what in the fuck? That is. Yep. It's even worse the second time. I, I can't shoot. So, what? Seriously? Alright, well. What? No, no, D doll, you fucker. Ah, you bastard. Come on, let me get some way to get the fuck out of here. Ooh. No, can't get inside of it. Come on, come on. God damn it. Dude, seriously. Key? No. Okay. No key. Okay. Damn. Mm. I can use that. No. Yeah, you can use that. Yes, yes, key. Key. Okay. Key. Key. And. You bastard. Get up now. Get up. Come on. Come on. Run. Run, you fucker. Run. Ah, I'm in. You better get in here, you fuck. There we go. Okay, cool. Okay. Um. Yep. So. Oh shit. Shit! 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 Come on, die, die, die. Seriously, die. Fucker, die. Why can't you fucking die? Die, damn you. Oh my god, no, I'm out of ammo. What? Seriously? Please, somebody give me a fucking gun that has ammo. Oh, whoa. Disgusting, but amazing. <laughs> Playing possum. He, he looks alive still. Fancy Even if he's playing possum. Oh, 
shit. Obviously, it's not good. You fucker. Oh. Come on. Why in the fuck won't the glass break? Dude, it should not be that impenetrable. I should have at least shot him. Oh, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt. Oh, this is really gonna fucking hurt. So many times. I lost count. Well, do you think we wanted to be in there in the first place, son? So long since I practiced my own fish. It's a dying tongue. Oh, boy. Okay. That's a big guy. That's a really fucking big guy. I've seen you before. Oh. Really? Is it? I'm speaking it. With you, I could do great things. <sighs> what in the I fuck like is in that suitcase? I'm sorry, briefcase. I like you. Not this one. Somebody oh. broke it already. What are you gonna make me do? Oh wait. Fuck, this is a decision from last time. Uh, who do I pick? Who do I pick? Mm. Who to save? I don't know. In your opinion, which one of these two varieties would best support my research? Okay, here's my promise. I'm going to do a second playthrough where I pick the person I, where I save the person I don't save this one, just just so I can see what it's like. Uh, I don't know if I'll actually publish it, but you know, maybe. Because I want to see what's different. I, I really do. But at the same time, I want to follow the gameplay I was just playing since I never finished it. So. You would have me dissect. Yes. Mm. In a selection, young, unspoiled fish mm. in the <laughs> You're still young. And the sad thing is, is that you really don't know war, so. Uh, I, I guess I'll have to. You promised us to live, oh. fucker. Oh. Uh, you're gonna burn your own guy just to make sure we die? Seriously? Well, I guess he is expendable. Huh. The expendables. <laughs> oh, wait, hold up. I want to see what's so special about this. You have unlocked the Ferguson timeline. This will allow you to access additional areas through the hot wiring skill. You can also find special health upgrades. Each upgrade will increase your health by tempo. Oh, so that's what makes everything different. Okay, I thought it was just like uh, a storyline thing, but I guess it does have a, its own little thing to it as well. Uh, yes, please. That is extreme flexibility. And you die. You get to die. Die. Painfully. I think 
Go get them all. Okay. So break open my cups, please. Okay, okay, so so we're gonna break these windows open by using these little lines. Zap, 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 yes! Okay. Get me the fuck out! Woohoo! Oh fuck. Okay, well. He can't be dead because he's the main character. Alright, well I guess that is the end of chapter one. Uh, thanks for sitting with us and watching it. Um, I will be re, you know, re-representing the, the, what the fuck am I saying? I, I'm losing my mind here. Alright, I will be doing an episode two as soon as possible. I will be unleashing it to Stitch. Hopefully he will be able to kind of mesh these things together for me. Uh, I do hope you enjoy the next episode that's coming up. I, if I remember correctly, there'll be a lot more interesting things happening. So yeah, uh, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.